Hey guys, Snake again, back with another video about Cyberpunk 2077. And I was holding off on making this video, but with what's gone on with the last patch, the 1.1 patch, and the stealth nerfs that have taken place, I just wanted to kind of get my thoughts and opinions out there. Um, I hope it's not actually a stealth nerf and that it's a bug that just made its way into the new patch. But I guess uh, only time will tell on that. Um, to preface this, I really do like the game Cyberpunk. I've put a lot of hours, about 200 hours into the game. Um, I enjoy exploring, trying out new builds. And of course, a lot of people really like the fashion in the game and dressing their characters up utilizing uh, the photo mode. So... Uh, First of all, the good about the patch was a lot of bug fixes and stability issues. I haven't personally had a crash since the patch hit. Um, I've been playing on PS4 Pro. So, um, on the other systems, I'm not entirely sure how they're doing stability-wise. So, if you have experience with one of the other systems, let me know. Um, so, that's good. Uh, there's still... A, a lot of ongoing issues and there's currently a game breaking issue with the down on the street uh, main quest where I guess the phone call you're supposed to get it uh, stalls out and freezes anyway um, so basically the stealth nerf was they made it so previously you were able to save and reload or leave and return to an item to switch its amount of slots as well as the rarity if possible and you're no longer able to do this um, so basically what this does is it makes end game take a huge hit because you can't really pick what kind of fashion you really want if you want to actually use full slots um, and honestly there's no real point in having rarities for gear if say a purple rarity item with three slots is gonna always be better than a legendary that has you know two slots because with armadillo mods and such uh, the difference in base armor is very negligible so now basically it seems like these items are locked when you create your character so no matter where in the world these items are located at once you create your character they're gonna be set and no matter how many times you re-roll or leave and come back they're still gonna be locked on the same amount of slots and the same uh, rarity uh, my problem with that is that they have a lot of other issues they should have focused on before they did any kind of nerf like that if that was something they were doing um, they did say they were fixing memory issues and that could possibly be a factor however with uh, previous saves you still have all the uh, you know four slot max gear that you got before the patch so it really only affects people in a single player game that it it punishes you it makes it so that these legendary sets aren't you know appealing to use even though they look cool because they might have less slots than a purple tier item that you find you know hot pants so that's my issue with that is that there's basically no reason to have rarity if they're not gonna make legendary always have more slots than epic say So it really uh, it hurts that it makes the crappier looking gear better in some instances than even the awesome legendary sets. And min-maxing is not really important in this game. Obviously you can blaze your way through the content with, you know, naked if you wanted to, honestly. Even on very hard mode um, once you get a good build going. But besides that, um, 
you're basically stuck, you know, wearing whatever you find if you want to min max, which you should be able to in a single player game. And that should totally be something that's encouraged, you know, and the fashion hunting once again. And I've seen suggestions of people reverting their patch file to a previous one because it's pissing them off so bad. So basically, yeah, I just wanted to say that, like, I'm okay with the overall patch, the stability improvements, the fixes to crashing, all of that. I am not okay if they did this on purpose and they're doing a stealth nerf, making some legendary items inferior to some epic items. That just sucks. And it hurts for uh, people that care about fashion in the game. But, uh, yeah, that's about all I have to say on the issue. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.